evening, wizards and witches. And hello, Philippines. Tonight will mark the day in which we will witness who reigned this year's Mr. and Miss Wizards and Witches Philippines. That's right. This last Thursday, a short announcement was made for the minor awards and here, before the coronation, we will start with the presentation of major awards. Ano-ano ba yung mga major awards na yan? May ideya ka ba, DHMS Charmaine? Alright DHM, ang ating pinakaunang major award ay Best in Attire. Buti na lang nakatago tayo na no, DHM. Mabuti na lang talaga dahil wala akong pambili ng outfit kung sakasakali. Pero ang malita ko, meron din Mr. and Miss Photogenic. Grabe naman yun. Sana all marunong magpo sa camera. Hay nako, mas mapapasana all ka rin dito sa Best in Introduction. Ikaw DHM, paano mo ipapakilala yung sarili mo kung sasali ka? Hay nako, Madam Deputy Headmistress. Madali lang yan. Hindi na lang ako sasali. Opo, lalo na dahil meron ding Best in Talent. Grabe, di ko makakalimutan yon kasi may naging vlogger dun eh. May declamation, may kanta, may tula. DHM, nagti-tiktok ko ba? Oo, pero wala pa na pa rin yung tiktok ng Mr. Gryffindor, no? Compilation eh, tapos may pa-piano pa ang ating Mr. Ravenclaw. Sana all nakapag-finger ng piano. We will start the program with a prayer to be led by our VTR. Yes, a shelter. Let us all bow our heads. Amen. To be followed by the singing of our national anthem. And without further ado, let us proceed with our first major award, Best in Attire in the Male Category. Sino kaya sa tingin ng mga audience? Pakicomment naman yan sa baba o. Oh. Sino nga ba di HMS? Our Best in Attire in the Male Category is... Tan -tan -tan -tan, Angelo Salvador! Charat! Busy yata sa k-drama ngayon. Kinabahan ako dun. Akala ko minanalong tagalabas. May we call on? Our High Inquisitor, Alisa Tandok, to read who is our Best in Attire in the Male category. The award for Best in Attire from the Male category goes to Mr. Mr. Ravenclaw Glenn Bryan. Congratulations! Good 
Congratulations, Mr. Glenn. Grabe daw kasi yung outfit niya sa mga rounds. At dahil nandito ka na rin, Miss Alisa, basahin mo na rin kung sino ang nakakuha ng best in attire sa mga babae naman. In the female category, the bear of the best in attire award is Darlene Pineda from the Ravenclaw House. Wow! A pair win from the Ravenclaw House! Thank you, Miss Eliza! Sundan na po natin agad ng Mr. Photogenic na i-a-award ng ating headmistress, Riz Alba. And now, we have the winner for Mr. Photogenic. I'll admit, all of our contestants are very handsome. But there was one who stood out. For the Mr. Photogenic awardee, we have Mr. Ravenclaw, Glenn Bryan. Congratulations! Grabe, another snatch! Patingin naman kami ng mga photos ni Glenn para mapatunayan ang kanyang pagiging Mr. Photogenic. Ayan, so pusin na tayo sa Miss Photogenic. At Therese? The Mr. and Miss WWPH 2020 pageant has just shown us how many lovely and beautiful ladies we have in here. But then again, one stood out. For the Miss Photogenic awardee, we have Miss Ravenclaw, Janderlene Pineda. Congratulations! Again, congratulations for a pair win! Thank you, Ate Riz! Ang next natin ay Best in Introduction. Sino sa tingin mo, HM, ang may mahusay na pagpapakilala? Hmm, medyo mahirap pumili eh. Kasi matatandaan mo talaga sila kapag pinapanood mo mga intro videos nila. Same! I feel you, DHM. Pero kailangan natin i-award to. Kaya tawagin na natin si Coco Commander Ciara para sa Best in Introduction Awards. And for our Mr. and Miss WWPH Best in Introduction Male Category. Congratulations, Mr. Glenn Bryan from Ravenclaw House. Greetings, all my magic and non-magic folks. I am Glenn Bryan, a with eight years of age. From the house of wisdom and wit, famed for its bronze and blue colors, Ravenclaw! Grabe, nakakatatlo na si Mr. Ravenclaw. Congratulations! Ituloy mo na, Miss Shara. And for the best in introduction female category, we have... Congratulations, Miss Darlene Pineda from Ravenclaw House. A pleasant day to everyone, especially wizards and witches. I am... Thank you, Miss Yara. And grabe, three consecutive pair wins na to. Makukuha kaya nila ang last set of awards? Huwag na nating patagalin at tawagin na natin si Commander Scott Micaela para sa Best in Talent. Commander, sino ba ang may mga pinakamahusay na talento sa kanila? Best in Talent, male, is Mr. Ravenclaw, Glenn Bryan. Music to our ears, playing piano wins best in talent. Gandang headline. Congratulations again to Mr. Ravenclaw. Pero kilalanin na po natin kung sino ang nakakuha sa mga kababaihan. Best in talent, female, is Miss Ravenclaw, Darlene Peneda. I am not just her daughter. I am Charmaine <laughs> Char. Tama ba yung nagawa ko? Grabe, di ko kayang ginawa ni Darlene dun. Congratulations, Miss Darlene, and sa lahat din po dahil naipamalas nyo pa rin ang inyong mga galing. Tama yan, DHMS. Salamat ulit, Commander. Maupo ka na kung nakatayo ka man. For everyone's information, 
criterias in our major awards were assigned based on the criterias of the introduction and talent portion. These criterias were announced ahead of time to the candidates. And each major award is worth 500 magical stones straight to the bearer's respective hard glass. And before we proceed to the coronation proper, let us first take our final look and get to know our candidates more by watching their introduction videos one more time. From the house of wisdom and wit, famed for its bronze and blue colors, Ravenclaw! A pleasant day to everyone, especially wizards and witches. I am Dirkin Pineda, 18, a Capitania, from the house that is symbolized by an eagle, combining the colors blue and bronze that values wisdom, wit, Ravenclaw! I belong in Gryffindor, where dwell the brave at heart, their daring, nerve, and chivalry set Gryffindors apart. Elijah Bahalia Baba, 17, representing Gryffindor! Getting lost late at night under stars Finding love, standing right where we are Your lips, they pull me in the moment You and I alone and people may be watching Rory, proud and loud from the lion's den My name is Chris Angelo Pagliogna 19 years of age, from the city of butterflies Dust Marinas, and I'm proudly representing the house of the brave, courageous and chivalry, Gryffindor! Is yellow too feminine for you? Talk about toxic masculinity. It's only color. Seriously, it's 2020. Come on. I'm Daniel John de la Vega. People have been telling me it's time to square up. I'm 17 years old representing the house with the gold. How about for the hardworking and tough? Oh, you think I'm an iser? You know what? Less is more. If you happen to disagree, I'll just shove you out the door. Why? You need some advice? Well, those who uphold loyalty should be treated as royalty! Who am I? I am someone who's representing the House of Badgers. As the Hufflepuff's real-life news commander, my kindness and loyalty drives me to do something extraordinary. I am Natalia V. Daban, 18, representing the House of Hufflepuff. Are you ready for the battle? Let's see. Oh, let me do it again. Good bye. I am Kirsten Lorraine de Kooten Orleans, 15 years old, representing Slytherin. I have always believed in saying that Slytherin will help you on your way to faith. Wizard and Witches, my name is Faisen Zenku, 17 years of age, representing the House of Slytherin. And I believe that being a Slytherin doesn't mean that we're cowards. 
Being a Slytherin means we know when to be brave and when to keep ourselves out of trouble. Thank you. And there you have it guys, our 8 lovely candidates. Sino kaya ang mag ng dalawang corona? Sigaw sa comments ang mga naniniwalang ito ay sina Natalia at TJ mula sa Half of Half. Mag-comment na rin ang mga naniniwalang si Chris at Elisha ng Gryffindor ang mag ng corona. Magpapatalo ba sa comments ang mga naniniwalang ang nagwagi ay sina Glenn at Darlene? Si Faizen at Kirsten ba ang magsusuot ng corona? Mag-comment na rin tayo dyan! After the long tabulation of judges' individual scores, we now have the result of who will take home the crowns. At this point, it is us who will announce the winners, and we will start with our Mr. WWPH third runner-up. Our Mr. WWPH third runner-up garnered an average total score of 86.538%, and he is... Mr. Hufflepuff, DJ De La Vega. Meanwhile, Miss WWPH, third runner-up, accumulated a total average score of 89.679%, and she is... She is Miss Gryffindor, Alicia Pahalia Baba. We now have them. Our third runners-up, Mr. DJ and Miss Elisha, will receive 1,000 points for their house. Congratulations! Following them is our Mr. WWPH second runner-up with a total score of 86.645% or a small 0.107% lead from the third runner-up is... Mr. Our Mr. WWPH second runner-up is Mr. Slytherin Faizan Zanku. That's very close. In here, with a rough half point difference, our Miss WWPH second runner-up garnered a total score of 90.133% and she is from the house of ambitious and cunning folks Miss Slytherin, Kirsten Lorraine Orleans Congratulations once again and both of you will receive 2,000 points for your house which is Slytherin Are you guys ready to know if Bravery will snatch the Mr. WWPH 2020 title? Or is it the Intelligent who acquitted his opponents? Did Honesty won over the judges and will bear the Miss WWPH 2020 crown? Or is it the learning that was most remarkable? At this point, we will announce the crown bearers or the title holders for this night. The names we will not mention are the Crown's rivalry or the first runners-up. We will start with the gentlemen. Our Mr. Wizards and Witches Philippines 2020 garnered a total score of 93.419%. And he is Mr. He is Mr. Wala ba tayong parafo dito or patubig man lang? Charot! Charot lang, heto na. Our Mr. Wizards and Witches Philippines 2020 is... Mr. Mr. Ravenclaw, Glenn Bryan.
Congratulations, Mr. Ravenclaw! Mr. Gryffindor, Chris Angelo Pagliona, as the first runner-up, garnered a total average score of 89.164%. The Ravenclaw House will receive additional 5,000 points for the title, while Gryffindor will receive 3,000 points. Once again, congratulations! And now, we will proceed to our Miss Wizards and Witches Philippines 2020. Our title holder for this night surpassed every candidate with a total final score of 96.88%. And without further ado, our Miss Wizards and Witches 2020 is none other than... Again, it is none other than... Dan 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 dalan dan 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 sarap ng real hindi po ito sponsor disclaimer lang again our miss wizards and witches 2020 is none other than advance happy new year po sa lahat o sa tagalog ay manigong bagong taon hato na hindi na ako magpapatumpik-tumpik pa our miss wizards and witches philippines 2020 is miss raven claw darlene peneda Congratulations, you will receive 5,000 points for your house. Miss Hufflepuff Natalia Daban is our first runner-up with a total score of 90.179%, a very close fight with our second runner-up. Miss Hufflepuff will be awarded 3,000 points for her house. And there you have it guys, our Mr. and Miss WWPH, Mr. Glenn Bryan and Miss Darlene Peneda. The intense fight has ended and to formally close our program, we will call on again to Commander Ciara for a short message. Thank you, Charmaine and Ravo. Good evening, Wizards and Witches. On behalf of the Higher Heads, we thank all of you for all your hard work and cooperation. This event will not be a success without all of you. To the participants, all of you did a great job. And always remember that we, together with your housemates, we are truly proud of you all. To the winners, congratulations. May you use your house traits to be a role model for our community. Once again, congratulations. This is your co-commander speaking. Magpapatuloy tayo. Thank you everyone and always remember to wear your mask. Have a great night. Thank you so much, co-commander. To all higher heads, the staffs, the candidates of course, to all the members who supported this event. I am current Deputy Headmaster Ravel. And I am the current Deputy Headmistress, Charmeka Lope. Now, now signing, signing off. off.